breakfast for champions. I've started clearing out the tomatoes. Not more, not really anything else is gonna ripen. So I've got to figure out something to do with the uh, green tomatoes I'm collecting, a chutney or something, but they're all dying back. And then I'm gonna plant them up with um, the salvias and uh, tender plants. I'm gonna bring them in here to overwinter so they won't be over soaked. You can see here's geraniums and salvias are already in. Up here, oops, I've gotta water them, they're thirsty. These are my seedlings of feverfew. These are honesty. This is ladies bed straw. That is some greater knapweed. And I think this is another greater knapweed. Here's more greater knapweed. My alarm and went off for uh, turning water off. Anyway, this is my devil's bit scabious. This is more greater knapweed babies that are coming up. I actually need to give them a bit of water. These fever few are getting thirsty. So this is wildflowers. People have asked me for baby wildflowers. Along here, there's a variety of difference. There's scabias, scabias. There's a lily, more scabias. But that's a tray. I'm hoping these are gonna come true because there's a lot of people who want devil's bit scabias. Um, so let's hope that these, these are the most recent ones that I've just um, sown. So they're beginning to come, but the fever few's gone crazy. This is brilliant. These I'm gonna keep for myself, honesty, and plant them where I want them. And they will flower not next year, but the year after. So, yep, busy, busy times. And look, there's still tomato blooms, but I'm gonna shift a lot of my geraniums and tender stuff that are along there bring them back here so the heat of the wall can have them so it's a lot of pulling up of tomatoes to overwinter everything else so a busy day what are you doing yeah you never pup You blend in with the hay, don't you? <laughs> Overseeing the job of replenishing hay. <laughs> so I'm being overseen again. Of them that's doing the job here. As I load all the tomato plants blooms and all, because I won't get any fruit off of them from the vine house. So, cleaning it out. Hey, kitty! He's keeping an eye on me as well. He's eating, that's a bit of cat mint. So he's getting stoned. Having a little cat nip. nip. What do you want? So you can see a bit of what I've been doing in here. You can see that tomatoes are all gone and the salvias and um, more tender. This is a very tender, which I love, fuchsia that I got this year. And the first frost got it, but a lot of its roots are there. First frost got this <clears throat> fuchsia as well. These are all a series of salvias that I'm hoping I'll over be able to overwinter in here. So hopefully I didn't bring these in too late. So I'm leaving their stalks on so I can remember to label them when they bloom. And fingers crossed. Then, as you can see, there's a lot of green tomatoes leftovers. So I've got to figure out a kind of chutney or something to use on my tomatoes. So, gotta trim back the grapevine. So it's all kind of winter maintenance stuff. Geraniums are still going in here. 
because they didn't get frosted inside here. Autumn is always sad, leaves off of trees. That amazing geranium, look at the different leaf structures, ladies mantle, geranium, uh, I can't think what that's called. But this hydrangea, look at her changing. It actually, how plants die is just as beautiful, or die back, maybe I should say, is just as beautiful as when they're in bloom at the height of the season. But that's, that uh, hydrangea is looking great. Okay. Oh, your mother is in your stable. I know. Isn't she awful? You go out. Go, no, don't take another bite. Go on. Go on. Oops. We don't want both of you out. Come on, good girl. That's yours. Yes, all well and good. Now, something is stopping. Ugh. There. Hey you, you've got your stable now. I know, your mother's awful, isn't she? Yeah. Your food's in the back. I'm coming up to see how the hay is for the girls as the rain falls. Ah, look, they're all in the shed. They've had their breakfast hours ago. I just wanted to check their hay. Oh, no, I don't have to refill their hay. You can see the hay racks are all lovely and full. You guys are doing well, huh? Staying in out of the rain. No food till later this evening. See you later.